Hello, friends and fellow citizens. Tom Nook. Hello, everyone. This is Tom Nook at 628 p.m. this happy Saturday, March 21st. Now for today's news. As of this very day, a brilliant young fellow by the name of Blathers will be joining us on Hodgetopia. Blathers has a keen interest in biology, past and present, and he's here to study Hodgetopia. I sincerely hope everyone lends their cooperation. Inquisitive residents should stop by his tent for details. That's all for me. Time for you all to get out and enjoy your day. Yes, yes. <laughs> now, you may have you may notice that there was some new patterns on the ground because we've had a, a new resident. No, I did not realize initially uh, that everyone in my household will be playing on the same island. <laughs> so, check it out. We've got, I'll check my mail in a second, but I've got a beautiful path, a beautiful walkway. Uh, somebody left me a chair and a bench and a campfire. And uh, the pathway, I don't know where, I guess it goes to some fishing spots. And it's going to go over here. And around a tree. <laughs> and over this way. It's a beautiful design. I love it. It's, it's as loud as it needs to be. There we go. And it heads over to our other resident's tent. This is where... Uh, uh, well, I can't remember what Zoe's name is. Sprinkles. Sparkles? Sparkles, sprinkles, something like that. Sprinkles, sprinkles. Oh, and here's the new place. Well, let's go check our mail before we get it going today. So this is going to be interesting because I'm probably going to play a fraction of the time than the other resident will. Oh, Sprinkles, dear Hodgepodge, I want to express my appreciation for all that you do for me. That's why I decided to get you this gift. I hope you like your shiny new outdoor bench. I just wanted to say happy moving to you from Sprinkles. Oh, that's very nice. Oh, yeah, I, I will just leave it. There we go. That's lovely. Thank you, Sprinkles. Very thoughtful. Now let's go check. I think the community board may also have some stuff, so let's go check that out. Oh, there we go. Okay, uh, I don't know which one. Life as a YouTuber is more than just playing things and videotaping things. You also get time to have fun and share new things together as a community. So have fun and keep safe. That's some advice for all of you from Sprinkles. We can do big things together. Sprinkles. That's very, very nice. And viewers who view this note, hug you. Sprinkles. Wow. That's lovely. I don't know if that everybody wants a big hug, but I guess a virtual hug to everybody out there that needs a hug right now. Okay, now let's go and see. Oh, there's a cot. I see. Oh, is, is was always sleeping out in the stars, or is this this new? Is this who's this new character here? A Gulliver. The waves. The waves are ready. The pool noodles. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Gulliver. Oh, hi. Thanks for waking me up. Blech. Mouth tastes like sand. I'm Gulliver. A salty sailor scouring the seven seas, see? More specifically, I was scouring this beach for something, but I guess I wore myself out and fell asleep. You look confused. Let me back up, see? I was sailing with my crew, fell overboard, and washed up here. Sail, fail, wash up, and tell the tale. It's a recurring thing with me. You got some problems, Gulliver, if that's what you're doing. Sail, fail, wash up, and tell the tale? If that's like a thing you've got on a t-shirt that you're wearing... I I worry for you, friend. That's there's a limited number of times you get to do that. But this time my hand this time. My handy dandy communicator got busted up. Now I can't call for a rescue. I'll need to find a few missing communicator parts to get this gizmo back to ship shape. Those tricky little parts are buried in the sand somewhere. Will you help find them? I'll look for them. Yeah. I gotta get a shovel though. Your heart must almost be as big as your head. <laughs> The communicator parts are probably buried in the sand somewhere. I'm just missing five parts. If you find them, I'll cram them back in here. I'm sure my crewmates are looking for me, so I better stay here and watch for the boat. I'll leave the searching to you. I believe in you, partner. I don't have much of a choice. <laughs> That's another great shirt. I believe in you, partner. I don't have much of a choice. See that right there? I'm guessing that's some stuff. Okay, well, let's... Let's go and I, I would have liked to abscond with this archaeological tool if I could, but let's go see what's happening in here. Okay, this is, uh, I don't even know what the character is going to, uh, we had an owl icon out front. It is an owl, alright. 
Well, hello there. Blathers. Who? A pleasure to meet you. My name is Blathers. I'm exceedingly interested in the ecosystem of this island. Thus, I have come to conduct research, if you will. Aha. Could it be that you are Hodgepodge, the personage who cho chose the location for this tent? I am. A splendid job indeed. Thanks to you, I was able to align on this island with a nary a ruffled feather. Now regarding the aforementioned research, truth be told, I am determined to open a museum and henceforth dwell in this island amongst you. So should you discover a new type of insect or fish, do be so kind as to bring it here. I plan to exhibit these creatures as well as those you gave to Tom Nook in the museum upon its completion. Though I confess there is one smallish problem regarding said museum. That is, I lack the number of exhibits needed to secure permission to open a museum proper. Empty display cases will not do, I'm told. Display cases with something to display, that is another matter. By the by, it is not only insects and fish I hope to exhibit my, in my esteemed institution, but fossils too. Ooh. With that in mind, I have a little something you might find helpful, should you wish to hunt for fossils. A moment, please, while I send the relevant data to your Nook phone. Oh, fantastic. I'm guessing this is going to be our shovel. Let's check it out. Oh, there, now I have sent you two DIY recipes. One is for a vaulting pole used for leaping over rivers. Oh, that is good. The other is a shovel, which for which you will need to excavate fossils from the ground. Hoot, I do hope you find these useful as I set out to search for fossils. My feathers, I have blathered on for far too long, but let me leave you with this. If I am to open the museum, I must acquire more items to exhibit. Nine more, to be precise. I fervently hope you will donate your precious finds to the cause. Fantastic. I'm excited about that, Blathers. I'm going to sit at your desk and do some work. Let me ruffle through here. What do you got in this desk? He set up really fast. Ooh. I'm just going to do some exercises, right? Just don't mind me. i got to get my workout on. Go real quick. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, that was cardio. What's with this, this deal here? It's kind of cool. All right. We're good. We're good. Let's go and make ourselves a shovel. There we are. Let's head over to the, the, the building table. That is the, the only thing it's hard to get used to when going back to playing on the Switch. Should I craft something using the workbench? Yeah, let's craft. There may also be stuff in the... Uh, oh, there we go. Oh, okay, let's, let's get rid of some stuff. Oh boy. What do I have in my pockets? I see. Okay. Well, we could. I don't know. I don't know what the 10 is for there when it says like, is that like we're maxing out the amount of like awesome power we have? I'm just going to eat a bunch of cherries. I'm curious. I want to see what happens when I eat 10. I mean, I know in real life what would happen if I ate 10 cherries. It probably would give me an upset stomach, but Maybe not 10. Maybe maybe a little few more than that. Okay. I don't want to use all the wood, so I don't think I want to... Uh, I don't really want to sell stuff. I do want to get a an extra... Oh, there we go. Okay, now I'm curious what will happen if I eat too many. You're too full. You couldn't pause it. Okay, that's good. Cool. Now, can I get a backpack upgrade from this thing? Once per day accessing, okay. Good, we got some bonus miles. I want to do some shopping. I want to see if, the, is there different things that appear here? No, not yet. Garden gnome. No, I do not want any of these things. Okay. What was the ABT again? Oh, right, I don't want to, I'm, I'm fine. I don't need to deposit things. Uh, no, let's sign off. We're good. Okay. Now, I wanted to look in here. No, there's nothing in here. Okay. I was I was playing with uh, as an associate of uh, Sprinkles yesterday, and uh, things were getting put in. I was curious about that. Things were getting put in there. Okay, so we've got our flimsy shovel. Let's make that. Yes, very good. I think I want to build that pole vault, but I think I actually have to clear my pockets out a little bit. Now, I'm wondering if I should go and back to the museum and see if I can hand in anything I've found. Because I don't know what this skinny's going to be on that. Let's go check it out. Alright, let's see here. 
Excuse me, Allie. Hodgepodge, splendid news, hooty hoo. Fossils have been found in Hodgetopia. Henceforth, fossil donations and appraisals shall commence in earnest. I await your contributions with anticipation. Please let me know if you have items to donate or need assistance. I'm here to help. Let's make a donation. Let's see. Can we donate? There we go. Yeah, pill bug. Felt like I had some things to get out of my pocket. Eek, a pill bug. The horror, the repugnance. Good heavens, I must maintain my composure. Ahem, I beg your pardon, bugs. I do detest them. Still, there's much I can tell you about the insect you apprehended. If you insist, that is. Please tell me. Ah, I see. In that case, <laughs> Blah, the pill bug. Children delight at the way these beasts roll into balls when poked, but the appeal is utterly lost on me. One look at their leggy undersides. Ooh, how they wriggle. Young pill bugs sh shed their exoskeletons as they grow, and in doing so, sprout another pair of legs. As if twelve appendages weren't alarming enough. Yuck, I say. Yuck. Any hoot, my sincerest thanks for your donation. And though bugs are the bane of my existence, rest assured the wretched thing will get the best of care here. By the way, by the by, I wonder if you have anything else that will be donated. Marvelous, what would you like to donate? We live in pillbug territory, as we're coastal here. We see pillbugs all the time. They, you get used to them. I remember at first they did kind of ick me out, and now it's like, oh, pillbug, just put on paper and set it free. Hootie hoo, this must be a squid. Now, might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your squid? Yep, yeah, absolutely. Wonderful, I'd love nothing more. Well, first off, squids are members of the mollusk family, just like the octopus. Many mollusks, like snails and clams, have shells, but the squid's body is almost completely soft. The exception is a long, narrow bit of hard material going through its main body, the last remnant of its shell. Of course, having your shell inside is not a best practice. Perhaps they lost the owner's manual. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Bravo and thank you. Once the museum is complete, it shall be displayed with the utmost dignity. With this, we need seven donations. Wow. Needless to say, I'm eager to accept your continued donations. Who? Very good. All right. So we have, we freed up two inventory slots. Now I'm wondering if I can, if I can dig things up here. Um, where's my shovels? I burned out my other tools already when I was helping out uh, with, uh, with sprinkles there. Look, I dug up a thousand bells. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Is there more there? Looks like there's more there. Oh no, I just filled it in. Nice. And then there's one over here by the entrance. So let's go check that one out. Oh, there was one. No, I'm wondering if someone else... Oh. I'm just going to dig a holes now. No. Oh my gosh. Can I cover that in now? Oh, let's try. There we go. Yeah, that's good. Let's, let's fill this pod hole in. No. Other one. Okay. There we go. Yep. I don't want somebody twisting an ankle. That wouldn't be good. Okay, let's run around the island like loonies. Oh, giant clam. Now, have we given one of those in already, or did I just sell them all? I don't remember. Gotta run, Timmy or Tommy, whoever you are. I'm on the go. I've had ten cherries. Look out. Now, I'm looking forward to building that pole vault stick so we can go check out the other area. Cause my suspicion is that I'm going to have to go do that. Uh, yeah. Oh, we got some more mail. Oh, another one. Dear Hodgepodge, wash yourself with gasoline. <laughs> Hope to keep yourself clean. Poem by Sprinkle, Lois Macintosh. I, I don't even know what Sprinkles is trying to get me killed. Wash yourself in gas. What? <laughs> Clearly I'm failing as a parent. Wash yourself with gasoline. Is there anything else behind my tent? Let's go take a look there. No. Oh, I gotta get to the other zone. I think I'm gonna have to build a pole vault. Alright. Let's get to that. Whoa. We can't dig through the tent, apparently. Alright. Alright, I'm here to build a stick, Tom. Well, uh, yeah, let's do it. Doesn't. I would have thought Tom would go to bed. Okay, let's build the vaulting pole. Oh no, I don't even have enough softwood. Oh boy. Hey Tom, what's going on bud? You hear what happened? Ah, hodgepodge. Hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. Uh, I'm good. I don't, I don't need to talk about what I need to do. I know what I need to do. Come see me anytime. 
We're all good. Let's go do our backyarder stuff. So we need some soft wood. Oh, hold the phone. I'm gonna need an axe. <laughs> that's that's the thing I'm gonna need. Okay, well let's go just double check that there's no other things to dig up. Hey, buddy boy. I gotta find uh, more diggins. I like running around like a lunatic with this shovel, though. All right, well, we'll, we'll grab the mollusk there. Now, yeah, let's go go get ourselves an axe. Axe it up. We'll get some more softwood. It is funny playing the uh, this in terms of real time that we're actually playing. Like, it's nice seeing the different times of day and all that. Uh, there we go. Oh, I need tree. I need five tree. <laughs> Tom, you're going to kill me. All this, this going about. Okay, I'm going to go shake this. Uh, there was a branch over to the left, but I'm going to first... Okay, let's... Uh, put away. Because I'm going to... i got to just violently shake this tree. Till five tree branches come out. Mm-hmm. Okay. There we go. Oh. Tree branch. Indeed it is. Huh? My pockets are full already. Should I swap it with something? Yes, we will swap it with something. Oh my gosh. What? Okay, let's go sell some things. <laughs> oh, it's endless. Isn't it? It's endless. Okay, good. Welcome. How can I help you? Well, I want to sell. Well, here's here's what I got. I've got a butterfly. I've got uh, two sand dollars, a Venus comb, a cowrie. Um, I feel like I should keep the peaches. A giant clam. And uh, that's all. Oh, are you sure? Well, if there's anything else. Oh, oops, did I not? Oh, sorry, kid. Okay, let, let's do this again. I, I was, and we'll get rid of those cherries. That's, I, I guess this is better. We'll uh, add more to the order. Look at all the fine things you brought in today. Allow me to just a moment to run the numbers. He's doing some complex math. It's, it's not, it's sums, man. It's, it's not... There's no square roots? Okay, you got it. And done. I can buy these for a total of 2,000 bells. Sound good? Sold. Thank you. Please come again. All right. Now let's go shake a tree. Let's go shake a tree. And there we are. Okay, now let's go make an axe. <laughs> I love the uh, back and forth in this game. Uh, it's funny seeing uh, the n the number of comments of a bit, you know, that compare this game and say, like, Stardew Valley. Like, Stardew Valley is like, Sammy's jokes, is a capitalism simulator. Whereas this game is like, like, you're just gonna chill out. You're just gonna, like, do some stuff, look at a sunset. Oh, no, I didn't want to keep crafting. Um, no, I'm gonna cancel. Now, let's see, what, so I needed, uh, yeah, it was seven or something. You're just gonna do some stuff and sit in a stump. Like that's this game is just mellow. It's no it's all good. Uh where's my axe? There it is. It is flimsy. Oh um, yeah, I already I got all the the sticks out of that one. These trees. There we go. All right, so that's one one more softwood. All right, yield your softwood. This tree is not forthcoming. Wow. The tree knows I'm weak. The tree's like we don't have to do anything. Pass it on. All the trees know now. Oh, hey, look at that. Oh, boy. Uh, this probably isn't good. 
I feel like I may have angered them. Oh, no. I can't do anything about it. Uh-oh. Give me some Benadryl. Where's my EpiPen? Ow, oh, wow, wow, I got stung by wasps. <laughs> Is that blind? Okay, well, I'm going to take your nest now. What do you think about that? Jerks. Nobody likes you. Oh, my flimsy axe already broke. Oh my gosh. I went to, I've got two berserker there. Okay, well, I guess we'll go make another one. Hold the phone. Do I, have, oh, I didn't build the pole vault, right? Because I'm trying to get, how much? Seven softwood. Was it seven or five? I think it was seven. My face is all swollen. I wonder if Tom Nook has some Benadryl. Hopefully I'm not having an anaphylactic shock. Hey, uh, hey kid. Yeah. Well, my face is swollen. I'm offering to sell my, my eyesight. Uh, what is uh, now wasp nest? I don't know. I think I'm going to see if they want to give that to the... Uh, oh, I could probably buy medicine. Let's see if I can buy some medicine. What's to say? Do you have any, do you have any medicine? You got a barbecue and an outdoor generator. Okay, here's the miscellaneous things. Look at this. Flimsy shovel. Oh, uh, let's see. Wow, I didn't even realize all this cool stuff was here. Hold the phone. Let's see. Cedar saplings. Okay, medicine. That's good. What else do we have? DIY for beginners. Flimsy axe. Water and can. Slingshot. Cherry. Wow. Okay. I can sell in singles or in bulk. How many would you like? Just one. Excellent purchase. Yes, thank you for the 400 bells. Anything else interesting? No, I think I'm good. Thank you. Please don't hesitate to ask me. Yeah, I'm going to take the medicine now because I'm dying here. Wow, there we go. Some socialized healthcare would be nice in this island. I'm just telling you, Tom Nook, it would be really good if we could sort that out and I didn't have to. Um, no, let's, I, I'm good. Okay, let's let's craft now. Let's do some stuff. Okay, so the pole was how many? Oh, there we go. We got it now. Perfect. I made a vaulting pole. Um, no, let's be done. And I'm gonna save my inventory space for the moment. Let's go try the pole out. This pole is going to get us to spots where we can go do digging. Let's see here. Let's hold this thing. It's probably it's going to wear out in five minutes. Oh, 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 oh what am I doing? Oh, no! I did not mean to do that. That stinks. Okay, well, I'm going to have to figure out how to deal with that. Sprinkles is going to be uh, furious with me. Okay, yeah, I can. Okay, I can pull vault over there. Okay, let's, uh, let's see. I've not seen anything down here. Hmm. Cherries. Wow, this is a huge area. Oh my gosh. This is fantastic. Well, you know what? I think I'm going to do, I think I'm going to take a break here. And that way, next time we come back, we can continue exploring. Because I'm probably going to just continue recording uh, another episode. So we're going to March 21st, probably two days in a row here. It's kind of how uh, I'm going to be doing it, I think. It's the best way for me to keep up with it daily. Because it's just, I'm fighting to get this the, the switch off of anybody because this game is too much fun. <laughs> At any rate, we will see you all next time. Till then, bye-bye.